gentlemen, y'all already know what it is. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. But first, let me hear from all of my gym stars. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the barbershop, BK the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video, man. Real quick, man, I know that a lot of people have been having issues with their uh, jump shot since the uh, since the patch. Myself included. I'm some people. I, bro, like my jump shot, they threw the timing off, and it feels like if I were to change to, um, if I were to change my jump shot to gold quick draw, then it probably will be okay, but I don't like doing something like that. So this is what I have concocted for you guys. And it's 2K Lab certified. Let me give you all a second to look at this. Um, more or less, this is what it is, man. Base 115, which has got the biggest green window on 2K Lab. They say it's pretty much the best all around jumper. Uh, release 134 and uh, release 14. And that's what we're going to be going with. I'm gonna show you the cue. I'm going to show you how to uh, what your badge setup should probably be, and then we're gonna let you guys get up out of here, man. So if you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content. Go check out that video that I put out earlier today while I was talking cash money. And uh, also, if you like these shirts and all this, I'm gonna actually put some arms on it where it's flexing, so it's gonna be the gym credibles. But if you like the shirts that I wear in these videos, make sure you leave your shirt size down in the comments. We reached 500 likes. We're gonna give away a free T-shirt, man. Yeah, you get a chance to win. So just all you gotta do is like the video, leave your shirt size down in the comments, and let me know if, if your jump shot is falling or not, man. Um, this is a bad setup that I had to go with with this just because of the fact that um, you need gold quick draw on this. This jumper, base 115 is a lot slower. And like I said, I, I feel like they changed a lot of bases uh, just in general. But with that being the case, I have concocted the jumper so that once you get it right in front of your face and his hand turns flat, you should be able to let it go. We're gonna shoot some jump shots. Uh, we're gonna chop it up then we're gonna get out of here. I know what you're thinking from the back as soon as you see fingers from the back As soon as you see his see his the fronts of his fingers You should be able to let it go like with this you're probably gonna just about have to time it I'm gonna be honest with you because it's really hard to see uh, From there but from here and everywhere else Up by the face let it fly Corner By the face let it fly Soon as you see his hand turn flat, I'm, I'm gonna stop it and uh, and we are going to, like I said, uh, I'm, I'm gonna stop it and let you guys see what I'm working with in a second. Okay, so boom, let's let's cap that, and then uh, what we're gonna do is I'm going to show you what the release point is or what the tail is on it, and then we're gonna go from there. Hopefully, we can get there as quickly as can. Um, I actually went through this a few times. I've actually been shooting this shot for about an hour, and I've been tweaking my releases a lot. And it's just because with the releases, I want them to be the most steady releases for you guys. So right here, you're going to see, you're going to go up, hand turns flat, that's, that's it. Then you're going to let it go. Boom. So when it's right there, up by his face, hands flat, and then you let it fly. That's all you gotta do, man. Um, like I said, I've been tweaking these releases a little bit here and there, but I love 134, 134 and 14 just because they give me the best flat hand release for me to see. And uh, if you got, and and uh, a lot of the whites go in with the, with this jump shot. And you'll hear me say this on every video: change the base, use the base, but use your own releases that you feel comfortable with, and tweak the releases so that you know you can um you can shoot the jump shot comfortably, reliably, and that you can time it. If you need to go down to um if you need to go down to to quick draw on on uh, silver or if you need to go up the Hall of Fame, do whatever you gotta do. But just know that the base itself is what really makes the jump shot. And then after that, the releases are what really help it go in as far as the whites go. You're gonna make a lot of whites, you're gonna make all your greens. It really feels like they've done something to shooting though, where 
even though you're not gonna shoot a green every time with uh even though you're not gonna shoot a green every time with uh these jump shots a lot of the whites are gonna i mean a lot of the uh, the no meat no you know no green none greens are going in so just be mindful of that because like last night in the wreck i kept shooting and i was hitting a lot of shots i just i just couldn't get any greens and i was like you know what i'm an i'm obsessive compulsive even though these keep going in i want to see some greens man you know what i'm saying if you like me put greens down in the chat man if you want to be leroy green like like even though i just hit six out of seven of those man this is what you want to see right now you want to see these greens nobody don't want to see you know what i'm saying you feel like an unskilled player when you just when you just hitting um no meter after no meter i guess that's what you're gonna call these like but you're gonna hit a lot of them with this i just like the fact that you can hit them because it really helps you like it helps your percentage out because like i said you know your greens are gonna go in but if you got if you got greens and you have something that you can make at a high make percentage you're gonna light it up man but anyway that's really all i have for you guys right now man um like i said i like this jump shot very rarely miss it uh had it on in wreck last night you know because i had to change my jump shot and uh it did well but i feel like where i have it right now is probably the best because i had to change up my badges and then i also had to change up the release once i, I feel like once i changed up the release it was a lot better not even gonna lie to you now maybe i will want it to be a little bit quicker but right now I think I'm okay with where it is. Like it's it's about as quick as I want it to be. I, I almost but and and the reason is because I shoot off sight. I feel like if you got it on Hall of Fame, you're shooting off field. And there ain't nothing wrong with shooting off field because once you get to the point and, and muscle memory is what I'm saying. Once you get to the point where you can shoot off field and you're not really even looking at it, that's where you really want to be. But you know, I don't like it. I'm not gonna lie to you. And the reason I don't like doing that is because let's say if I do this right here then it's gonna be different you see what i'm saying if i shot off field with that it's not gonna be the same and so and so you know that's that's my reason for that but anyway this is a really green jump shot man hope you guys enjoyed the video if you like the video like the video subscribe for more daily 2k content let me know what else you guys want what badge combination you guys want to see if you want my defensive badge conversation uh, com combination leave me a like man i'll put that video up for you i will put up footage of me uh you know real real gameplay uh we got a lot to talk about tomorrow too in the news so make sure you subscribe for daily news and let me know if y'all want me to do nba uh stuff too man if not you know it is what it is man i understand i i, I get it um, it's a gaming channel. And so we got to do gaming related stuff. But I got to get up out of here, man. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Champ. Godspeed. And like I said, if you want a chance to win, make sure you like the video. Um, leave a comment with your t shirt size. And, uh, you know, that's it. And then we're going to squad up in the comments. I'll be down there so for about the first hour or so. So just ask me what you got to ask, man. All right, I'm out. Peace.